My whole life's been a cook. And I was an executive sous chef at Sunday River. And my son was born. And uh, it was just too demanding to have a family life and a professional life. So I was looking for something with more flexibility and Hancock offered it to me. So I started in not knowing a thing about sawmills and they've worked with me every step of the way. And no matter what, personal life is top priority over all else. So. I've been with the company for about five and a half years now. I started just on the floor, within a couple of years worked up to the molder and then got certified as a pro molder operator. Now I've started training multiple other people in the process and I'm going to, I'm going to do that more throughout the year. I come in, worked hard and it just kind of flowed into those positions and new responsibilities and did them and did them the way they wanted and it worked out and it's continuing to work out by just putting the effort forth. I started here in 2011 um, in February and I had no idea how any of this worked. I had no idea about lumber. I'd never even dealt with lumber before. But I picked it up pretty quickly and I was hired on full time in April of 2011. And by October I was a supervisor of the molder. And then I did that for eight years. Through that, a lot of my job was quality because it's a lot of pattern. And grade was a part of it as well. So it kind of moved me into that lucidine position when, when that arose. I didn't really expect to be there, but it turned out really cool. I'm excited about it. It's a business but it's also a way for pe people to make a living and, and the, the point of it is to enjoy it while you do it. Safety is important for everyone. Uh, yeah, we all want to go home at the end of the day the same way we came into the mill. So everyone knows their roles, their walkout, tag out, their, their procedures for working on broke down equipment. If anyone has questions, the supervisor is right there to ask them. They're extremely professional but laid back, so it's a lot of fun here. Um, and like I said, it's just the whole shift of dynamic where your family life, your personal life is number one, and I've never experienced that before. It's pretty crazy knowing that this company's been alive for 175 years and still thriving. Hopefully Team Hancock is around for another 175 years. 